Hey guys, what's going on? It's Griffin, and today we're going to be playing a little bit of Black Ops 3, and we're just going to do a few custom maps. I think we're just going to choose the one for this video, maybe post another one shortly with another map. Um, but we are currently live streaming. Um, so the map that we're going to try, let's have a look at. Download a few um, that we will be going through. Now. Crusty Crab Challenge. Let's have a look at that. Yeah, this is the one. <coughs> Let's jump into it. It's a bit weird loading um, actual modding maps that people have made themselves. They're pretty, pretty unique in a way. But here we go. Let's just jump into this. There can be no gobble gums, and it's going to be normal standard, no chaos mod, no nothing. Um, so yeah definitely jump into this hopefully it's not too hard um, I think I previously loaded this just to check it I think early in the day and it was relatively all right but we'll see won't we um, once we jump in <coughs> perfect first things first let's get our quick revive just pause it very quickly and just move this keyboard out of the way. We are playing on the PS5 controller. I do feel like I've got a bit more control. I am slowly learning to use the keyboard and mouse. I use it for the majority of every other game that I play. Um, let's get that kill first. And see if we can get some loose change from the machine. No. That's quite annoying in a way. Oh, is that the power? I <laughs> think. Probably should have had a little look around just to see the aesthetics of this video, of the map, sorry. So yeah, so we've got probably like 10 to 15 maybe layers that we need to get through. Um, so I reckon we stay in the starting room. I think that's what I, I figured out to be the best strategy for this. Stay in the starting room for as long as we can because it just gets absolutely chaotic as soon as you leave. Um, and then I think the plan as well was while we're in the first room we can get both of the wall weapons and then work our way up see what perks we can get as we escalate our fans through the tower i think it was yeah i think it's just here we go yeah perfect i don't really want to kill them yeah we'll shoot him in the legs see if we can get okay perfect and now as we win it's not exactly what I wanted just knife this guy a few times best thing it's more nostalgia really isn't it like everyone knows how many bullets you need to put into a zombie with the starting pistol like what is it like you can put four to six on the first round Full clip on the second round unless you're doing headshots and then it's just like eight and four eight and four and then obviously it's two clips for this one unless you get a few headshots okay i lied <laughs> i'm not entirely sure myself eh? i do feel like this gun has got a little bit more power um i need to be careful for them as well then what the other one was. Don't really want to get that new. Okay, we'll get that now. Um, yeah, um, so far so good. Get the RK5 as well, just so we can actually switch out in case we run out of ammunition on one of them. <coughs> so, yeah, what I was saying. Can't remember what I was saying. Lost track, lost train of thought. This gun. Um, it's surprisingly a little bit stronger than when we jumped in just to test it. So, fingers crossed the IQ5 actually stays up with this. Yeah, there we go. Definitely not as powerful. But, I mean, as long as we're getting the... Can we? No, definitely not. so yeah I think what I was trying to say is 
should try and be careful of the. Um, I, I think there's like a few like barriers. The, that zombie was not dying. Um, yeah, yeah, there's a few barriers within this um, that are gonna stop us in our tracks. Like you see here, there's one here. Not sure exactly what it is. Is that a, just a zombie? Yeah? <laughs> They're pretty much everywhere. They're littered. So we just want to literally make sure that they can't get out of the ground. We'll grab that. Yeah, and I, I think as long as we can do this for as long as we can, like maybe round eight, maybe nine, if we can get to them rounds anyway, um, staying on the first floor, just so when we actually progress we can skip quite a bit just get some good decent perks um just for survivability really i, I think there's a few perks that we're going to want we're going to want um dub tap um juggernaut and um let's get some ammunition while we're here a bit wasteful but we're going to need it <coughs> yeah there's a, a few perks that we're going to need speed color as well because you're quite defined quite, quite tight um, map itself, so we're gonna need speed cola. Double tap, definitely a must. Quick for five is gonna be there. Our saving grace for when the skill issue is apparent. But literally, if we can just maybe avoid death in the first, maybe eight, I want to say if we can get another round through, another round in. Yeah, because. Okay, there's a max ammo there. We'll definitely try and empty all the ammunition we've got. They're just not we'll definitely get it now. I feel like the RK5 isn't supporting us in the way we want it. Can we save a thunder? Yes, we can. Right, let's try and as like ascend. See what we've got. We've got the standing up and the bar. Definitely not. We've got dead shot. Definitely not. And then what's this? FG42, we've got Juggernaug, and we've got Double Tap and this. Yeah, we'll get this. PDW. I swear to God, if we down then, that would have been a mistake. So I feel like I'm going to make the tactical decision of getting a Double Tap first. Maybe camp here a little bit. I don't know what the spawn's like. I think there's one spawn here on each. Yep. And then hopefully, if we can <coughs> just prioritize or get our reloads perfectly then we shouldn't have any issues I mean they jump it they're coming up pretty fast and pretty slick not sure I'm a fan of it okay let's um, get a quick reload in here and I think I want to go for as much as I want headshots we we'll have to do a little jump here. Yeah, this is what I mean. What I mean it reminds me of the um, Call of the Dead Easter egg. Okay, let's um, try and end the round quickly so then we can actually get some use of this. And then we can jump down and get some juggernaut. And, and then how much of this this is? I don't know. So we've got speed caller there and the ST. Of the user, I think the STG we definitely will grab. We might need some more ammunition for this, but hopefully we can maybe survive one more round. Maybe get speed call up before. Okay. I swear to God, if I went down, then do you know what? There's still a chance of us actually going down. Oh. And the new comes in clutch, eh? We'll get this. Definitely get this now. I want to see if there's any. Can we? Oh, we got that. Four K for that door. Definitely doable. We are in dire need of a double point. Yeah, I think that's definitely the tactic. Tactic that we want to go for. Okay, that was a quick round. We will get some more ammunition. 
So then we have 4k for that. Do we want another gun? Point nah, this definitely by far the best. We just need to get I wanna say double points and then hopefully we can actually progress a little bit faster then. And then we got Juggernaut, we can literally take it here too. Maybe jump off. Yeah, we'll get that. Maybe... Oh, this is where it gets a little bit sketchy, because you can literally drop off and then the whole game just dies there and then. I think we're doing alright, first run. Yeah, this is a nice little tactic. A little bit of cheesing. Just using the levels to our advantage. Okay. Alright, now that level, that round is done. Can we afford to... Do you know what? We're just going to stay here. Just a little bit longer. Since we've got the instant kill. Um, then we can get rid of the, that gun. Obviously, if we can get the, the knives in, be a bit more cost effective. For us. Let's try and get a reload in here. Right, yeah, this is where it's going to get a little bit sketchy. We have to make sure I preserve the ammunition just enough so we can get some more. Yeah, perfect. Honestly, perfect timing, and I'm so grateful that. The zombies are getting stuck there. And this gun is actually not hitting as hard as. Oh, you're joking, man. <laughs> what a joke. <clears throat> okay. Gonna have to be quick here. So now we're down insane amount of points. 4.5k lost. Gonna have to make it to the bottom floor. Grab this dead quick. And try and make it up all the way so we can ensure. So we've got enough money to progress if we need to. I really do think we should buy some ammunition. That was a bit of a waste. Do you know what? We're gonna do it. We're also going to buy this. Reloads semi decent, but we do want. Yeah, we don't need that. We can switch out the weapon, save the ammunition on this one. We're going to need that. That is going to be a priority. Let's see if we can get as many stabs in as we can. Didn't want to get a chef up that one. Right, okay. Perfect. Yeah, we're doing great. Smooth. We've got the easy there. Which I might purchase just to see if mm, a K and a half. Got four and a half K. Mm, AK. Yeah, okay. I'm I'm content with where we at. Where we're at. Um Yeah. Is going to make that massive difference here. And then, as long as we can keep getting zombies to spawn there, it's going to be absolutely perfect. And, and there as well. One thing I also want to say look at is this. Yeah, perfect. Let's try and avoid that nuke at all costs. I like I like the spawns on this one. There's one here, not too in our face. There is down there, down there, and then is that last one? Yeah, perfect. Um, I'm really thinking we should get some ammo for the PDW just to get them extra points. Now we're not that many floors up until we get to a situation there. I didn't actually check on the initial run through, um, which I probably should have. 
tile for the map. But we're staying a little bit in the dark, which I think is a good thing. We're not too clued up. And it's going to be like a, a surprise for us all, to be honest. And I, I do believe when I actually read the description of all this map that there is no actual perk limit. And I, I really, really, really do hope it's. And that's the case, um, as we are going to need more than the initial perks that we've got here. Um, I probably should have done for. We're going to move up. AK. For you, it's gonna be. I think we'll definitely get that. Widow's wine, three and a half k. Can we get it? Can we get it, please? Nice and gold. Now, who remembers Black Ops One gold camouflages? Like they were, I want to say, the all-time, my all-time favorite, anyway. But 20, 20 ammo in a clip is actually really bad. Um, four and a half k for that. I want to see what gun that is. I'm not sure what perk that is. And the reload's nice. Max ammo. Love to see it. Do you know what? I, I would like to see. Oh, I would love to, like, maybe get a hot tank hold off. Do you know what? That was probably one of the best purchases that we've actually made. It was wine. I think from here and now we've got a little bit more saving grace, especially in these tight spots, as long as we can keep the zombies not hitting us so we can save the actual grenades. And I think we'll be in a, like a, a better situation than we would be without them. So we can literally just let them hit us. Can we end the round there quick? Can we grab some ammunition for this gun oh that was a bit too further down i wanted hopefully we can actually get back get some ammunition and grab that double points before it runs out i'll be fuming if i don't make it yeah perfect that's a waste of the grenade i've got unlimited so we're gonna have to make sure that we use the stg while we can and avoid that nuke as well if we can. We will use it if we are in dying need, but why these door points is happening. Let's try and not waste grenades. Had to there, had to switch weapon. As long as I'm reloading just before we get down to zero ammunition, which I'll be. perfect. I was gonna say it's gonna save the reload speed. A massive amount. This is insane. Insane amount of points. And we have one more. Can we kill them? Yes, thank you very much. Let's get some ammunition for this. And let's move on up. We've got mad amount of points. The K, the K, M, and then the mule kick. Do we want mule kick? I mean, it's two and a half K. We're gonna do it just for the two and a half K. Okay. LSAT we're gonna get <laughs> Bible ending 30k right my question is where are the zombies spawning are they spawning up here with us no 30k I reckon we can do that <clears throat> and then we got a little bit of choke like a little bit of a choke point here we can I would say we want to stand on that step, get as many kills as we can, and hopefully they'll come across from the right. I think this this map's. I think we've. Like I want to say we've done relatively all right in this map. Um, I want to say we've had kind of only one mess up. Um, but I don't want to say. I want to say that we we haven't really. Oh, it's a mystery box. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Good work. Sorry, pal, but this is my kitchen, mate. I'll tell you what, we'll, in between rounds, we'll definitely be making sure we hit the, hit the box. We don't want to miss up on any opportunities that we can get from that. Just to see if there's any like special weapons that are being put in. 
Um, and as well, is there any perks that we need? Any perks that we missed? Because I know we said we can get, um, there's no perk limit, so fingers crossed there's more to it than this. And then I think, I hope that we've got the right one in the next slot. Because I'm going to have to use it. I, I reckon maybe in the next two to three rounds, but at this rate, we're going to have 30k in. Yeah, we've got the yeah, effort. As long as we've got the LSAT in our last spot, just to ensure. Right, okay, let's get to the box. Rapido. And we might even upgrade a few weapons. Don't want to. End the game too fast. So I love how we get the amazing guns like that. What's this? Five London, nothing else in here. <coughs> oh, we've got instant kill. We could probably hit the box. <laughs> hey, can we see it from the back of here? Oh. Okay. We want that. <laughs> no. Right, what have you done, Liam? What have you done? Can we get a grenade? Double points. Oh, this Scar H came in clutch. Perfect time for it. Have you just spawned behind me? Yes. Please don't be spawning behind me, please. I mean, this is pretty scuffed. That Widow's Wine is literally coming clutch. Like, with a max ammo, I can just take a hit. And not even have an issue so 23k points it was 30k wasn't it I feel like 30k is a bit too little but we're gonna hit a box a few more times we're gonna get rid of the KPK MP40 no thank you let's see what we can get MP5 no thank you can we throw a grenade there ray gun I mean yeah i mean not really any use to us for the main reason there's no phd on this no phd i'm i wish i could go out there these are all just come to watch the uh, the show like i've seen the saw movie when they're in the, the town center or uh, the city center and these um them three people they the like the girl and the two partners that she's um, playing and live in the actual town the, they've got to choose and that, like the, the tv show i would say but yeah th that's literally it we are the tv show they're wanting us to fail they want to see some gruesome things let's just double check again let's reload this weapon 30k we're pretty much there um, I do want to see what else is in the box. I don't want to just. So, okay, the miles are. <clears throat> amazing gun. Absolutely amazing when it's pack punched. SVJ. Um, can we get the miles are pack punched? Let's, let's have a little look. I want to see what it looks like. See if it's actually top tier or not. Yeah, because I don't want to. I don't want to run out the game dead quick. I mean, the tower itself initially is a little bit hard. You're probably watching this thinking, ah, there's no way that's hard. No challenge in that whatsoever. But I think if you, unless you stay in the like the starting area until you, you can afford all your way up to double tap to the PWR or any little further just to get the initial perks to make you do the damage at them rounds, then. It's gonna, I would say it would be a challenge. I know we've down once. That was just to make the uh, the pack creator just feel like he's just one up me there. Just one up there. You're welcome. But here we go, the amazing gun. Absolutely amazing. <laughs> okay. Who remembers this gun? I swear this was Modern Warfare. No, was it? Was it? This was MW3, wasn't it? Definitely was. I, I remember it. 
M two three. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was. It's an absolutely insane fire rate. I want to see exactly what five pounds can pick up with pack punch. So let's just go and pack punch. And then we'll pack punch it Elsa as well. Um, evolve Death Stalker. Oh, I mean, I was going to say this gun absolutely slaps, but we've got instant kill, so we're not really sure. But yeah, reload fast. Fire rate is insane. Not enough for the zombies though, so let's try the. I know we, the Elsa is literally slapping them at the moment. The F certs. F certs. <laughs> Do you know what? We're gonna pack a punch the Scar H, we're gonna test it out, and then we will jump on out of here unless we can see any of us in the box that we want. And we'll even intensify this a bit. We'll, we'll see if we can be SpongeBob. We'll try and make a crowd fire at the same time as hitting the box, see if we can get some decent weapons. I mean, the Scar H before the pack punch was absolutely slapping. I mean, we're on round 23. We've actually flew through the um, the rounds there quickly. Uh, but, I mean, next round? Nah. I think we'll have a, two or three more hits on the box, and if we don't get anything decent, I think we can call this one. This one's a definite. Imagine if I went down there, got no more widow wine. Oh my! <laughs> oh yeah, I jinxed it, didn't I? I absolutely jinxed it. I think. <laughs> Can we survive? Yeah. Do you know what? I think I'm gonna call it after this. I don't wanna. I don't wanna save you the pain of having to watch me run all the way up here. And there we are. Thanks for playing. You have escaped. That is literally <laughs> one of the. I'm gonna say it was a really. It was a nice little challenge. Um, not too aggressive, not too hard. I wouldn't say. Um, but hopefully, we, we should find maybe if they've got an actual additional map for this. See if there's an actual like higher tiered one. I do like this SpongeBob theme. I just feel like they, they could have been a bit more implemented. Maybe. Yeah like a one window challenge as you're in like yeah that'd be i think that's a, an absolute cracking idea if anyone's watching and you know how to make the maps make that literally a one window challenge bikini bottom crusty crab spongebob's kitchen literally and then i want all the zombies coming out of the window from above the um the grill where as he passes the uh, curry fighters out so if you can do that that'd be amazing Happy, honestly, so so happy. But that is literally all we have for this video um, for today. But make sure that you show the support. Maybe like the video, subscribe to the channel, and please turn on notifications just so you can, you're aware of when we next upload. We're gonna be posting quite a lot of Black Ops Three custom maps at the moment. Um, maybe a few Modern Warfare Three zombies as well. But I wanna. I, I want to get back into this um, modding maps, and I really like it. So I just want to just push a few out there, show you some. Like, I think there's a, a few maps that I really want to like play it a little bit before I actually play with you guys. I'll play for you guys, but that is literally it for this video. So please show the support, and I will see you in the next one.